Hi, brother and sister of the week. This is Ali Alami from Expo Cigar Kuwait. We continue the cigar chase and we brought you a great cigar shop from Geneva, Gerard. Gerard is the first who brought the cigar bank to the cigar aficionado and he is also the producer or the manufacturer for the air kill system for the cigar launch. We'll go inside and you will meet him. Say hello to him. Ali, good afternoon. Good afternoon. How are you? Good to see you. Thank you for coming. Thank you. I'm for very happy to you. see you here. Thank you. In for Geneva. Welcome to Geneva, Ali. Thank you very much. Now, Mr. Gerard will help us and show us what we have here in the shop and we'll go with him. What you have to understand, Ali, this concept of store was unique in the world. We, maybe in 1980, were the first people in the world to build a cigar shop. When I said to the cigar shop, in this place you will find only cigars and handmade. That's, that's one of the criterion we did for the cigars, but also behind this, um, nothing else which is not related to the cigar. That's nice. Um, pipe, it's another story. We will not do it. Tobacco for pipe, we will not do it. Cigarettes, forget about it. And so on, so on, so on. It was only the concept which is born in 1980 of this place, born from my father and mother, because we are a family company for the last 55 years. And we built this, the vision was really what a cigars lover would how will be the dream to have a garden for a cigar lover? That's nice. Let me let me do this. Let me to show you this. Okay. First part, what we did here in the windows, it's all the accessories what people need most of the time. These accessories most of the time are lighters, are how to cut the cigars, how to prepare the cigars, and some are making sets with the pans and things. But mainly, it's the lighters which people like. And like you know, we have extremely different kind of lighters, you can go from the cheapest to the highest and most expensive one. But I said few brand names, important brand names, well, um, they, which they have a very well manufacturer of those lighters help. And especially that now the world of the lighters has been extended because uh, during those last 10 years we saw on the market now the torch coming on before it was the the soft things, you know. Yeah. Okay, but what you have to understand also, we are not using any lighters with benzene. Uh -huh. Why? Because the smell of the tobacco will be not will be inter yeah will be an interference. The taste. And based on this, if we're talking about the lighters, we yeah. can talk about the cutters, and we go on the humidors, and we create also and we design also our own humidors. We have some humidors from great companies, but we have also our own humidors which we design. This is the last one which we designed also, comes in different colors, as you can see the black one, called pointe, in French we call it pointe de diamant. And this is a humidor which you can keep 75 cigars in your house, in your office, whatever you like it. You put the cigars inside, you are happy to keep the cigars humid properly, which nearly about 70, 73% of humidity in permanence, that makes you the tobacco is still soft and good. And Automatically, when you start the lighters, people want what goes with the lighter. Very, don't forget that this cigars world is quite men's. Even if we have ladies who buy cigars today, it's still a very men's world. And automatically, you're going to find the things which are coming with this men's world. The lighters comes with the pants. The pants come with sometimes the belt and so on and so on. So it's it's been really men's world. So you concentrate on certain brands. Always, or, yeah. always brands of quality. Yeah. Which, you, for example, here you have Estée Dupont, okay. which is a great French company, which makes uh, a lot of new things also, which uh, designed a lot of new items, uh, which understood very well what was the uh, need for the for the cigars lover. Okay. You see. And the other brands? We don't have so many brands, other brands, because the other ones it's we are designing also, okay. are, and we love to design the new product. For example, we design like you can see this traveling humidors. Um, this is for nine cigars, you know. Uh, we saw that we, we need a traveling humidor uh -huh. for cigars with a small humidity, which makes you the per facility to go and come back when you are in yeah. traveling to bring your cigars. You have some bigger humidors where we keep the cigars also in the box of cigars inside. Okay, so that's manufactured by your company. Yeah, we design them, we select the colors. You have, for example, this, which is a famous design, is the pot. Uh -huh. This appear in your... Ceramic pot. Yeah. 
this appeared in 19, uh, if I don't make mistakes, in year 1999, we start the first ones. But uh, the advantage of this, in fact, after maybe some other big companies and big names did it already, but we were the first ones. But don't forget that if you go back in the history of the cigars, some big brands used to have pot in glasses, you see. Uh, we, we did not glasses for the only reason that this, the sunshine can go through. Oh, okay. And if you want to keep the tobacco well, the porcelain is much better than the glass because you keep a certain freshness. That's correct. Automatically, when we talk about cigars, you talk about something else which goes very well with it. It's rum and whiskey. Okay. This place, if we were in 1935 or in 1940, this place will be full of cognacs and armagnacs. Today we're in 2016. 2016, people love whiskies and rum. Okay. Because between you and me, rum was a pirate drink, you see, <laughs> 50 years ago, even nobody knew about that. Uh -huh. Today, we have excellent rum. And the pairing which, will be okay between rum and cigars? Uh, the pairing is very nice, very soft, you have different rum. What I will try to do is to go on the, the rums which they don't, do not have too much melassa or too much sugar. Okay. But behind this, if you take a pure natural rum, okay, you have an excellent pairing. And the wedding is a really a nice wedding, okay. up to your taste. So now we will go cigars. Now let me to show you the world of the cigar which we are. The, the vision which we had in this place, okay, it's, and, and some people will love this place and some others will not. But when I designed this store, the store was not like this before 2006. When we designed the store, I designed it because my wish was to have like an open space. Okay. Open space means that you feel free to move in this place. Uh -huh. All right. And not, I didn't want to have like an old style British cigar store, which I love them also, but it, I'm spending 10 hours per day in this place and I want to have a place where I can move, come back, forth and back, you see. Okay. And this is very important. Now, for the cigars, what we did, except that we put a very pic picky technology for keeping the tobacco in the really good temperature with humidity, and but we, we did a selection of like I told you before, only handmade. We have the major Cuban tobacco. Um, come with me. I yep. will show you one of the vision, uh, maybe which is maybe one of the nicest painting of the cigar. If you come here, and I will be front of you. Okay. I can talk to you even. Yep. See, this is this is what we call uh, our wall. The wall is mean that you have a pleasure to see different cigars. Also, we in 1999 we start to. In fact, look at some other place than Cuba also. And I thought it was important to bring some other cigars, not uh, to be competitive because that's nonsense, because the quality of the Cuban cigar is unique, the taste of this tobacco is unique, but like I can tell you, the taste of Nicaragua is unique, the taste of Costa Rica is unique, and the taste of Dominican Republic is unique, and, and so and so. That the, the, the challenge was, was what? Was to, we saw that uh, those factory was making a huge effort. Not only the factory, but also the tobacco fields were becoming more and more interesting. That's why we said, and we saw that people were, the, the challenge of after the 1980s, 2000, people start, start to look for some other taste also, with interest, you see. Um, we can compare this situation a bit. Don't forget that we are in Geneva, middle of Europe, and don't forget that we can compare this with the wine stories. If we go back about 50, 70 years ago, people were talking about the French wines only. Today, I'm not telling you that the French wine is no good. French wine is excellent, but has its own typicity. And suddenly, you saw excellent Italian wines. You saw excellent Argentina. American wines from New Zealand, from Spain, from... And this is what is making happy the consumer to try once uh, Italian, to try once, and we have exactly the same way in the cigars. I mean, I, I'm not telling you that he's gonna love it or don't love it. I mean, we are over than this. I think it's good to have an interest for a quality product. Quality products means good tobacco, means perfect manufacture. This is what we people like. And Dominican also give us the advantage to start to blend how we like. Okay. And my way was, I start this about year 2000, to start to dream about a cigar. Like if I was a good cook, who was making cook, and telling you, oh, today I'm going to cook this food. How can I prepare this food? 
and what people would like to eat also. Okay. Okay, and I think it's two comp components which are important. What and what people are looking today, people are not eating like 25 years ago. They change their way of eating and so, but also how the product we have today, where can we push this product? How we can, you know, and this is why we, we start, for example, today, if I'm telling you this is one of our best seller, I'm not it's very understand uh, this is a tobacco for example we did this in, is your in, yeah this is one of the last one we born it's it's a 60 ring gauge okay. all right and and has a we call him the super robusto you can understand this but but also give you an, a very nice fragrance and taste and aroma why because first it's very easy you don't make any effort to draw on this yeah. it's coming to you but on the other hand for this one we use tobacco from Honduras Ecuador and Nicaragua and this blend makes me a taste which is unique for this multi multi -lanky. yeah that's right that's right and that's what that's one of the last one we did and and i think this is a bit what people are waiting from us to be creative to be to bring some new things to bring to bring some some new taste you have tobacco from this this is our brand okay which is take a, a big place in our place because every day every day, every day the heart, the people, core, people the core are coming through. but you you can find also this is a, one of the last baby we came and introduced this in the in the swiss market it, it's a, a septimo septimo was a brand which has been done in um in costa rica costa rica very interesting until now we never saw very beautiful cigars from costa rica but we start to see those cigars very well made also I would say quite expensive on the one hand, but on the other hand, yeah. uh, you can take a fiability for the tobacco, which is the taste, which is nearly always the same. And this is very important. And behind this, you will find also the great brand cigars of the Cubans, which are divide. You have also some vintage cigars for the lovers. You have some new cigars also, and so and so. And what was important is to have this choice that people are happy to discover. Don't forget that we welcome people which are coming here with a very big knowledge on cigar uh -huh. and they know very well what they want and this cigars lover from long time and you have also this new generation which is coming which are i will say curious to discover different size different taste different and we have also to answer to those people this is very, that's why i've wrote different books uh to help the people to understand the quality of the cigars uh -huh. that's great so now you are providing them the knowledge and the variety of cigars yes and this is our job. Yeah. Thank you, Ali. It was a pleasure to see you today in Geneva. Okay, man. Take care of yourself. Gerard shop in action. You can see here the accessories. And the big all here. You can find the mini can D'accord. Beautiful edition and, and the also Okay, in the end of this tour, Mr. Gerard, thank you very much for the great tool. Just we have we need to a small info about your project, the first one, the Bank of Cigar and the air flow system that everybody wouldn't know about it. Can you please? Uh, the, the, the Bank of Cigar is, is really to help the consumer to keep his cigar. We have more than 750 say, uh, high technology to keep the cigars, and here we age cigars for some five years, 10 years, 15, 20 years. Okay, and, and how people they can access to that? They automatically send us an email of what they want, and we provide everything for them, and we'll bring them. Okay, mm -hmm. there is any extra fees? Until today, no, but maybe it will change because the square meter becomes very expensive <laughs> in Geneva. Okay. And what was the new great system, the Erkel? Ah, Erkel is another story. It's a new baby for me. Um, the vision of Erkel is to, you see, everywhere where you, we go, we have a smoking lounge. And 
smoking lounge, people are not happy with it. The, the, the jacket smells, the hair smells, you cannot invite a non-smoker to a smoking lounge. My, my vision six, six years ago was to do a cigar lounge and not a smoking lounge. And a cigar lounge for non-smoker. This is very important. Uh, by this way, my, uh, I would say the philosophic view of Erkel is to join, again, people which don't know cigar and people who love cigar. They can sit, uh, they can sit together. And this is why we start to work on this project, which now is a patent, international patent. Erkel becomes more and more interesting for the hotels, for the restaurant, um, for the, even for the private houses. Here we did the big bank, we did the headquarters for a cigar. Access for this system to you? We, we, for sure, because we know how to do it now. It's, it's, uh, we, we have more than 17, 19 RKL in the world, which are in Zurich, we have in Stad, we have in Geneva. Now we have people from outside are coming to us, Asia, Middle East countries. And this is very important because I think, I don't want to say that, but on the other hand, I think that Cigars Lounge tomorrow in the Five Stars Hotel will become important like we use with the spa. In the beginnings, nobody was making spa, and suddenly you have spa in all the hotels where you go. It's been, is a need of some people. And the cigar lounges becomes a need for some people. Automatically, when you make the lounge, you have everything that goes with this but You cannot sell something in this lounge if the quality of the space is not good. And when, I, when I'm talking, talking quality, I'm not talking furniture, I'm not talking design. I'm talking the quality of the air. Today, air in air care, it's more clean than outside. And that's why people enjoy it. And they can sit, drink the coffee, drink the tea, invite non smoker with them, and we we'll really find back a place which, I, I love to build this place, and a place which should be like this for me. Excellent. So in the end, what about this book? Ali, this is a book which I would like to keep for you and sign it for you. It's one of the last books which I did. Yeah. This book talks about the cigars. It's a coffee table book. Okay. It's, it's not a technical book, but I love, I love this book and every picture of this book, behind this picture is a story about cigar. That's why this one, I would love to sign it for you if you don't mind. Thank you, thank you, thank you, you Ali. Thank you. 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 Thank you.